Oh god, Coach House and Woodland. Alright, here we go. This is probably the hardest climb in Adelaide. I'm only saying probably because I still can't pick between this and Cherryville. This is a little bit longer, but it doesn't quite have the same average gradient. But it has that brutal finish to it, but Cherryville is just so consistently hard and oh, it's just, oh, they're just both awful. All I'll say is go out and climb both and, you know, make up your own mind. I still haven't made up mine. So let's focus on the task at hand. Coach House Drive, 9%, 700 meters. Pretty damn tough, but it's just the entree. The main is the dreaded Woodland Way, the triple kicker. Oh god. So we've just turned onto it and we have 1.4 Ks averaging about 12% ahead of us. Yeah. And it just gets harder as it goes along. The first two kickers are pretty bad. They both top out at about 15 or 16% each and they're followed by a well, I guess it's a recovery gradient, but it's only 8%, and that's pretty much as good as it gets on this road. So it's pretty demoralizing to ride it, and then it's pretty demoralizing when you get home and upload your data, because you'll be able to see just how much worse you are than Green Edge rider Damien Housen, who has the KOM. Just to spoil the surprise, you are a lot worse. But hey, who really wants that lifestyle of getting paid to ride bikes in awesome places all over the world? Ah, damn you, Damien Housen. That talented jerk has this KOM and Norton Summit. What a bastard. At least let us mere mortals have Strava. But enough jealousy for now. You're about to enter one of the hardest bits of road in Adelaide. This is up there with the wall at the top of Coach Road and the wall at the bottom of Sheoak Road is a long, sustained stretch of 20 plus percent. And to make it worse, you've got some shitty, shitty surface to rumble over because of how narrow the road is here. Ugh. But the good news is, we are just starting to roll over the hardest part. The gradient is starting to slacken off to a pedestrian 10% and the finish line is in sight, which is pretty much wherever you want it to be. You're done. Well, actually, there's still a little bit more, but this video is too long already. Now get out there and ride your bike after you hit subscribe, of course.